Welcome to Kids Story Library, where children's stories and creativity come together. Dive into a collection of original, short, fun tales featuring characters who embark on adventures and learn important life lessons. The enjoyment continues beyond the stories. We offer wonderful colouring pages for each tale on our website, kidsstorylib.com. These pages provide a canvas for creativity. It's perfect for quality time with your little ones. So, choose a story and let the adventure of learning and creativity unfold. In the sunny savannah, there was a young giraffe named Ginny. Ginny lived in a cosy nook under a giant acacia tree with her mom, dad, and a little brother named Gabe. Ginny loved reaching for the highest leaves and playing hide-and-seek among the tall grass. Every day, she would wake up to the bright sun and the chirping of birds. Ginny's world was filled with joy and laughter. She and Gabe would often race to see who could spot the most animals. And at night, they listened to stories under the starry sky. One sunny morning, Ginny noticed that her mom and dad were having long talks and sometimes seemed sad. Then, one day, her parents sat her and Gabe down to talk. They explained that they were going to live in different parts of the savannah, which meant Ginny and Gabe would sometimes be with mom and sometimes with dad. Ginny felt her heart sink. She loved her family being together. The idea of them living apart made her feel like a cloud was covering her sunny world. She thought about all the shared meals and laughter, wondering how everything would change. Ginny felt confused and worried. She wondered if it was her fault. Did I eat too many leaves? Did I play too loudly? she thought. She noticed the changes. Her dad moved to a grove near the river and her mum stayed in their cosy nook. Ginny missed having both parents together. She felt a little lonely and often found herself gazing at the empty spot where her dad used to sleep. Gabe too seemed quieter, and they would often just sit together, looking at the stars, wishing things could go back to how they were. Ginny talked to her best friend, Ellie the elephant, who had experienced something similar. Ellie shared, When my parents started living in different parts of the jungle, I thought it was because of something I did. But my grandma told me that sometimes grown-ups need to live apart to be happy, and it's never the child's fault. She explained how she learned to enjoy the different adventures with each parent. Ginny listened intently, finding comfort in Ellie's words. It made her feel a bit better knowing that someone else understood her feelings. One evening, sitting under the stars with her mom, Ginny shared her feelings. Mom, is it because of me that you and Dad are living apart? Her mom hugged her tightly and said, Oh, Ginny, it's not your fault at all. Your dad and I made this decision for many grown-up reasons, but it has nothing to do with you or Gabe. We both love you two more than anything in the world. Ginny felt a weight lift from her heart. She realised that her mum and dad still loved her and Gabe just as much, even though they weren't all living together. Over time, Ginny began to understand and adjust to the new arrangement. She had fun adventures with her dad by the river and cosy story times with her mum under the acacia tree. She learned that even though her parents lived apart, their love for her and Gabe would always be as vast as the savannah sky. Ginny started to see the bright side of things, double the birthday celebrations, two different bedtime stories, and lots of new adventures. She knew that whatever happened, her family's love was like the endless sky, always there, no matter where they were. They died.